No, absolutely not. Come on, man. I've never asked you for anything before. Yeah, apart from the weed incident, right? And the, the fake IDs and the stripper, whatever, man. I need you to come through for me now. Are you serious? Getting the shit kicked out of me is not what I signed up for. He's not going to kick the shit out of you. You know what? You're right. It's no big deal. Let me just waltz up to David, the ex-NFL linebacker, and say to him, Hey, big guy, you know that pretty little ring that your mom smuggled out of Auschwitz while breastfeeding you and fighting off Nazis with her bare hands? Yeah, Bryce lost it. Okay, firstly, a little inappropriate with the whole Auschwitz story, right? And second of all, dude, he's not going to let my best man rock up to his daughter's wedding looking like he's gone 12 rounds with Mike Tyson. Okay, plus, I kind of think he sort of likes you. Likes me? Are you high? What, a little bit? You think people can tell? Okay, you really think he likes me after my drunk ass turned up uninvited to his 60th? After I tried to do a line from the poolside bar and then knocked his mom into the pool? Getting caught having sex in the gazebo with his niece really cemented our relationship. Mustache Mary. Aw, oh, dude. Do not mustache marry me now. No, I'm calling it. Mustache Mary. Come on, man, it's for my wedding present. My hospital bill's gonna be your wedding present. There he is, come on. We gotta be out there in five minutes. Let's go, 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 go. You're such a dick. I love you too, come on. Fuck you.